news that we had throughout the day. There was a big moment uh, that happened uh, just moments ago that we want to bring your attention to. Some stations might not be covering this. We do, and we bring you everything that's happening in the world of news. It was a big win right now that they are calling it. The Trump campaign is calling this one a big win in Pennsylvania as the Pennsylvania court secretary of state lacked authority to change deadline two days before election day. A Pennsylvania judge ruled in favor of the Trump campaign today, ordering that the state may not count ballots where the voters needed to provide proof of identification and failed to do so by November, November 9th. State law said that voters have until six days after the election this year, that was November 9th, to cure, cure problems regarding a lack of proof of identification. After the Pennsylvania Supreme Court ruled that mail-in ballots could be accepted three days after Election Day, Pennsylvania Secretary of State uh, Kathy Bukvar submitted a guidance with said proof of identification it could be provided up until November 12th, which is six days from the ballot acceptance deadline. That guidance was issued two days before Election Day. The court concludes that respondent Kathy Bukvar, in her official capacity as Secretary of the Commonwealth, lacked statutory authority to issue the November 1st, 2020 guidance to Respondents County Board of elections insofar as the guidance purported to change the deadline for certain electors to verify proof of identification. Judge Mary Hannah Leavitt said in a court order. This was in line with the Trump campaign's argument, which was that there was no basis in the state's law to extend the identification deadline and that Bookvar did not have the power to unilaterally change it. The court had previously ordered that all ballots where voters provided proof of identification between November 10th and 12th should be segregated until a ruling was issued determining what should be done with them. Today, Leave It ruled on that those ballots shall not be counted. This was one of several legal challenges the Trump campaign is bringing in Pennsylvania. On Friday, they are scheduled to have a hearing over thousands of ballots that they claim were improperly counted despite lacking required information. Additionally, and this could be a big one, the campaign awaits action from the Supreme Court regarding whether the Pennsylvania Supreme Court acted properly in granting that three-day extension for accepting mail-in ballots there. So we'll keep an eye on that for you. All the big breaking news right here on News Now from Fox. When it's happening now and it's happening with the news, you know we got you covered. Covered right here on News Now from Fox, everybody. We continue to roll on.